Hey coders, and welcome to Not The Code Zone. Today, we're at the Google office on a field trip. We'll be seeing a real life tech professional, so let's go see her. Hey, Kehlani, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Doing so well, it's great to see you. Isn't it great to like be here? I love yes. working here. Well, I'm really excited to show you more and tell you a little bit more about what I do. You wanna come and check it out? Yeah, of course. All right, let's go. How did you end up at Google? Funny story, I applied to Google when I first graduated from college, but I actually did not get accepted. Um, so it was kind of sad, but you know what? It taught me a lesson just to keep going and keep trying. And maybe there's a place you have to start um, a little bit smaller. So I kept applying to some smaller advertising uh, companies and got my start there in digital advertising. And I always kept thinking about, what about Google? What can I do? So I kept applying and finally, one day I actually got an email from a Google recruiter reaching out to me and I finally got my acceptance at Google. That's great. You know, I think it really taught me just to never give up, right. but to, you know, work on what can you bring to a company. Right. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, so it was really cool to get here. Yeah, that's fantastic. <laughs> so what do you like most about working in tech? I really like all of the smart and cool people and new inventions. We can really build cool things for everyone. So I think tech allows us to connect the pieces and honestly interact with more people. I'm from Nigeria originally, wow. and a lot of my family is still there. So I can use social media to connect with them, or we can use Google search to find things to like that we like to do together. Yeah. That's great. So what's your job? Yeah, I'm actually a global product solutions lead, which is a handful. But what it really means is I sit between our market, which would be our advertisers and our sales teams, and between the engineer teams. So if our advertisers have some feedback or product suggestions, I can take all of that in and then share it back with our engineers and our product teams to see if we could build those features for them. So are you a coder like me? <laughs> you know, I actually am not, but I do work with a bunch of coders and engineer teams. Our engineer teams and, and coders will build features and scripts to help our search campaign serve better. Right. And so if they build new features and want to know if it's actually going to work or be useful to our customers, I'll then take some of those ideas that they have to our customers and get their feedback to see like if it, it's helpful and if they really like it, or if it's not helpful, how can we improve it so that it would be helpful for you? So what kind of skills do you need for your job? My job is actually more about relationship building, building relationships with my engineers, with my product managers and my advertisers. Um, and these relationships are really key to make sure we're hearing from everyone. We wanna hear from our advertisers about what they like about our products, and we also want to hear from our end teams and really figure out what are they trying to build. So when I hear from both parties, I bring these conversations together. Yeah, it's not as technical as you would think, but it's really important to have good relationship management and building skills so you can you know, work and collaborate right. efficiently. Thank you so much for telling me about your job. It was my pleasure. So I actually have a really fun activity for us today. Um, would you like to check it out? Yes, of course. So let's go. What we're gonna do is actually redesign Google's logo using these crafts and supplies. From there, we're gonna take our two designs to our Googlers and beta test to see which one they like better. Cool, let's get started. <laughs> <laughs> With an A-B test, we're taking two fairly similar things. They might just be slightly different and seeing which one drives better performance. You really want your logo to be attractive and inviting so people click on your name and actually want to figure out like what services you do. We then look and see which one is actually performing better and then we launch one completely in the market. 
Okay, let's put the finishing touches. Are you done with your design? I am. Oh, okay. That's cute. How's mine? Yours is cute too. Okay. Well, how about we get the Googlers in here and see which one they like better and do our beta test. Okay, cool. All right. Hello, everyone. Hi. Hi, Hi and welcome to my beta test. Thank you. Thank you so much for attending. So I have two logos and I'm going to put both up and see which ones you like, okay? Woo, great. Awesome. great. We have these two. Woo! Thank you. Now. Got it. Uh, one more time. Woo! you guys also enjoyed the Google Office as much as I did. I was able to have so much fun and learn so many things, especially about being able to create and run a beta test. I'll see you guys all in the next episode. Bye!